Welcome to the Procrastinator's fucking podcast, and let me just tell you today, if you thought your grandfather dying was bad, if you thought your dog shooting himself was bad, you are not prepared for this travesty of pure, unbridled misery we have for you today on this Procrastinator's podcast. We have we, we have a devilish person just saying within our ranks right here, we will get into a moment here, but, but, but before we, we, we break out your bones, before we break out your back, before we break out your your literal tomb that we have here for you today. Let's go over the normal people who you already know and you're and, and you're so sick of hearing that you might as well unsubscribe right fucking now. We, we have Nate. We have Nate. Who cares? Toblerone. Yeah, you see that, that stuff so like that. Good. Stuff like that happens on the podcast. A, so your, your, yeah. your spine is the Toblerone. Okay, go on. Uh, we we have we have Ben. Minecraft. <laughs> this is what you're getting into. This is this is today's episode. Uh, Hippo. <laughs> yes, it's me. We have Tom. Insert meme here. We have Mage. MC Mage, <coughs> new channel. <laughs> MC Mage. We, we 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 have we have fucking legendary YouTube and my personal hero. How the fuck did we get this guy? Fit MC. How do you do, fellow kids? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Fuck yeah. All of the okay. cool kids have MC in their username. That's right. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Uh, let's get into backstory for this guy, because this guy is fucking important. He's crucial to understanding this entire topic. Okay, the MC okay. is a fucking dope-ass YouTube, like, M- Minecrafter, who I, who I found myself, and I was a fan of for, like, like a, like, a year and a half. And it was great, and it was fantastic, and I can't, like, just by one day, by chance, he commented on a piece of the episode, and I blew my fucking mind, and I had to, like, like refresh the page. Page, like two times to make sure I wasn't fucking dreaming. Here he is. <laughs> but, w- w- would you like to describe what you do, Fit? Um, I'm a mine man, you see. I'm a block <laughs> boy, as they say. It's, uh, <laughs> for the past like for the past year and a half, I've been convincing people that I'm actually a YouTuber, but I'm not. I'm just uh, I'm just a guy that holocausts children on a Minecraft server. That's all I am. <laughs> yeah. Hey, block hey, of head more, and block of soul. Goal is that? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, hey, fit. Can I just? Can I just? I'm just gonna address the elephant in the room. Just rip this band aid right off. What are your feelings about mining at night? Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be some div- divisions right off the bat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> your, your words will scorch the earth. Ay, ay, ay. I mean, I love Minecraft. But the community is just something you tolerate, you know. It's- yeah. <laughs> oh, oh That's no. True. That's true. It, you yeah. know when you when, it, the, when you the, live it's by just anarchy. Such a tidal wave of mine at night. You, you can't you can't combat it all. You can't possibly hope to combat it all. Now, as, as I'm sure you realize, as I'm sure you realize, dear viewer, today's episode is indeed Minecraft. And of course, what is Minecraft? No one knows. We have to consult the only good book that there feasibly is. UrbanDictionary.com, and, and let me tell you, I, uh, I I read a few of these before the show to um, get myself immersed. And let me tell you that this is like rivaling on nice. This these are the worst definitions we have to work with. Oh, so no. I'm just gonna read a couple here. Minecraft, cheap and legal alternatives to drugs. This shit will sap <laughs> your life away. <laughs> uh, Minecraft, a kick-ass game that is being built slowly. The creator is Notch, and he programs the game. And, and, and I Not anymore, bitch. I specifically like the um the, the words here. Person one, hey. Person two, shut the fuck up! I'm playing Minecraft! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, there's um, there's like five different ones about it being a drug. Yeah, you you get the point. It's a fucking video game. Yo, <laughs> hey, 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 hey! I went to get addicted to it. Yeah, just get this. I went to knowyourmeme.com, and that has oh, a vastly fuck. superior yeah. definition. It's just okay, Minecraft okay. is an indie Java video game created by Marcus Pearson. It is a sandbox mining slash building game in which the players gather blah 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 various resources, combine them blah blah blah. Developed a lot of online following blah blah blah. YouTube videos blah blah blah. It was released during Minecraft 2000 or Minecon. Nate, shut the fuck up! There I'm playing. Minecraft. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. The video game. The, the video game. We need to lay down some fucking groundwork here. We need to lay down what the fuck is going on. We need to have some frame of reference going on. And there's no better frame of reference than how much of a new fag are you? What update did you guys join on? Oh, Jesus. Uh, 
I mean, Nate, if I'm not mistaken, you, you literally first played Minecraft on a stream, right? If you if you on go my into stream, yeah, yeah, what what yeah. channel can they find that video on? Game? Uh, Where do those exist uh, now? Gibbon Gaming somewhere. It's Gibbon one Gaming. Of, one of the Minecraft streams there. Nate tries uh, to right. to play Minecraft, and he learns about tries. redstone, and he's really he's really excited about like various very mundane things, and I laugh at him. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That was like a year ago or something. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Fucking uh, incredible. I I have no idea what that was, and that that was that like that was easily wet, like like that was a one point ten or something like, like that. So, it was, yeah. it was like, pretty like, hilarious yeah. because I I am I am a I am a noob. I'm a I'm a Minecraft weakling, and and because even I was old. even I was like rolling yeah. my eyes at like the things Nate found to be like, huh, it's really interesting how Minecraft do this, and I'm like, where have you been? It's 2017. <laughs> when I learned that you could put obsidian in a block and spark it with a flame and turn it into a portal, it literally devastated my soul on a deep <laughs> fundamental level. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I remember the specific update I joined on. It, it was beta one point six when the, when the, when they added dogs, and 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 I played exclusively within a browser. Like I I played only Minecraft in a browser, which was like extremely rampant at the time. Like you could just like like upload. Wait like, wait wait the wait wait. A, br a browser like, like on your computer? Yeah 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 yeah. Like, I, like, well well like, hang on I don't understand. Explorer. How did you do that? This is an exclusively three DS game as I understand it, and I was going to say how impressive it was that all this stuff on 2B2T was built on a 3DS. Like, that's really, <laughs> you know, that's impressive. That's impressive stuff. I, I think if you're, I think you're thinking of the uh, the mobile uh, hit smash game Jurassic Park Alive, where you can go <laughs> and run across your I, own I, GTS I often world and capture too. dinosaurs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, 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 that's fine. <laughs> okay. um, yeah, and, and I remember, I remember, I remember my first moments playing Minecraft very vividly because it, it was like a nightmare. It was like a real life <laughs> nightmare where I joined, and then it turned nighttime, and then yeah. just a skeleton yeah. appeared in my peripheral, and mm -hmm. I had no idea there were monsters or that like nighttime was a feature. I was just walking around, just hanging out, and then there were very spi It was terrifying. It was fucking terrifying, and uh, I'll never, I'll never forgive you, Notch. I'll never fucking forgive you. Uh, X. Um. I, I I think I started playing Minecraft in, in a browser as well. I was think I was in college or something, and I just like fucked around with it. And I made no headway, and I found it frustrating and opaque, so I gave up really quick. Um, and then like every like once or twice, like a friend of mine would be like, "Hey, I play Minecraft. Join my server." And then I uh, I would uh, jump in for a little bit, fuck around for like a day, and then give up and not play it again for like two years. Um, I played on I played on Hippo's server for a little while a while back uh, before I think the server's dead now but I made I was very proud of myself I made a little hut I just like built a little stone hut right next to uh, Hippo's um, aquatic base and uh, I hope it's still there sometimes I think about it and I'm like man I hope that that little hut didn't get destroyed and taken apart for its pieces um, but I remember the one time that I almost was in danger of getting into Minecraft legit it was during the pony day <laughs> the extreme perilous danger that yeah, is yeah yeah, yeah 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 the the sword of Damocles was yeah. was almost whatever um, it was during the pony days when we were, it was in the it was in the heyday of the of the the, the torrent of quality content that was <laughs> Tbat plays. Mm. Oh no! And I oh spent no listen oh, okay because because that was around the time that I had just gotten into <laughs> um a uh, uh, Shadow of Israfel um in the Yogg's cast and I and I had watched all of Shadow of Israfel and thought that it was the coolest thing ever. This is gonna be the most embarrassing podcast we've ever released. <laughs> um, wait, shut up. <laughs> Um, so I, um, I, um, I, I spent like weeks, I spent like weeks trying to figure out a way to get a modded version of Minecraft where we could be ponies, we could be Phantom Horn and Keg Standard, oh, and I thought yeah. that we could do like a, like a, like a sh Shadow of Israfel kind of thing. <laughs> oh. Um, that's a I'm having, I'm having, I'm having the flash, I'm, I'm having the heats, I'm sweating <laughs> Cause, profusely. Because, because like, because like, if you, if I tried to Google it, and like, there were some like pony mods of Minecraft, but they sucked, and like, they didn't, I don't know. And, <laughs> yeah. and, I, and I couldn't think what happened. Surprise. They stop. all sucked. I couldn't figure. I couldn't figure out how to make it work. Um, Finn, when did you get into Minecraft? Do you remember? Oh yeah, it was the summer of 2010. I was just your typical <clears throat> college broham, and I was browsing <clears throat> V on 4chan, and that's back when Notch himself was actually advertising on V. I remember those days. Yeah, yep. so he yep. was posting some threads, so I decided to check the game out, and like I thought it was pretty sweet. I'd never played anything like it before. <laughs> I thought it was awesome, and then. Here I am, eight years later. God, 
literally the most powerful <laughs> Minecraft player of all time. Making that sweet bank. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. Oh my god, the, the return investment on that must be fucking it. insane. It's because you're paying for a beta and stuff, you know. So. Yeah. How, how much does Minecraft cost nowadays? Twenty six ninety five. I just I bought it. Holy yeah, shit. Uh, I think I paid twenty for it. Like. Yeah, I, I paid. Why is the price right going here. up as opposed to down? I mean, like you know, uh, I guess with updates. Product. Well, I think it's probably because when Microsoft bought it, they're like, hey, guys, let's jack this price oh, up a little bit. Well. I guess so. Well, whatever, whatever. Also, my, my, inflation, question mark? Uh, <laughs> no. Let's, let's not open that kettle. Let's, not, let's not bring on. your fetishes into the equation right now, Mage. Please. <laughs> <laughs> no, Mage, yeah. Mage no, when I, did you I, get into Minecraft? Let, oh, let's, let's um, gosh. When, when was Minecraft created exactly? Like 2008, it will, 2009? It, it, went, it went real in 2011. Because, like, I think I that's around the time I got into it, uh, 10, maybe, 2010, maybe mm -hmm. 9, I'm not sure. Uh, because I remember a friend got it for me because there was no way for me to buy it at that point. I was still living in Lithuania, no credit cards, whatever. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, he got it for me. For, it was, like, $17-ish at that time. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, and that's how I got into it. I, I remember I was the only one who could, who could figure out how to host a gosh darn Minecraft server with, uh, what's that program? I hate that program. What's it called? Windows Movie Maker. No, no, no there was like... <laughs> Minesweeper. Uh, Hamachi, uh, uh, there we go. I, I host my one. Minecraft server on my TI-83 calculator. <laughs> yeah. 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 That, Gotta launch Hamachi. that Mirage OS guys, first. No, 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 guys, do you know Hamachi? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah sure. I, 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 I tried, I tried to set that up. Little oh, did I know God. it was way more complicated than just doing it normally. I, Hamachi yeah, like awful. back then, back then, yeah, Hamachi was like the only way you could really do it, and it was awful. And I was the only one who could figure it out. So I, I tried had to host fucking the with Hamachi to post Brutal Doom with some of my friends, like to play mm -hmm. cooperative online, and that was hell on earth. And I, hated I'm it. never touching Hamachi again. Well, well, never. Mage, that's 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 interesting to know when you got into Minecraft. But when did you then upgrade your life from Minecraft into one of the Many shittier version clones that you love yeah. so dearly. Shitty. Well, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna well, fight me and you. Me and played <laughs> one with you. It was one where it was it was like a Creative weird like, hybrid like Terraria Minecraft weird it, it fantasy has, fucking it had pets. It oh, Mage, had, like, it was just pets. the pets. Yeah. And Mage, something. aren't you also big into paladins? You were the one telling me trying to get. Oh my paladins. god! No, 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 no! I didn't. I don't like paladins anymore. They changed. Mage, the game are you the one into angry birds? Always talking about angry birds. This and angry birds that. I'm frankly sick are of you, hearing about it. Are you the person who's always on, trying to advertise Jurassic Park Alive on all of my friends? <laughs> well, that's a classic. A classic is a classic, my dude. You guys need to stop. <laughs> <laughs> Mage, tell tell us about some some of the many fine Minecraft alternatives yeah, yeah. out there. Creative versus good. I mean, like mm -hmm, va mm -hmm. vanilla. Like in comparison to vanilla Minecraft, I much prefer creative creative verse. It's a lot mm -hmm. prettier looking, at least for me. That's true. Uh, That's true. I, li I like the building aspect. I like the pets. I can have like every single creature can be turned into a pet, and I love that. It's it's a favorite thing to do. And I honestly don't know how to sell the game. Just like, check it out. It's free. There we go. That's the best seller. That's a good it's one. Free. It's, it's yeah. Minecraft, but free. And That's pretty good. Shit. That's pretty good. Mine, Minecraft, but does everything Minecraft can do, but better, and, but better and for free. And, for free. Yeah. Yeah. and, and it can host servers so easily. You just make a make a world and like you host it and the, there you go. It's up forever and everyone can join, be it offline or online. You don't have to host it yourself. I mean, you can you can host the servers really easily, but you know. There's no one to play with because no one. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> savage! <laughs> play it. Well. All right, oh, who else we got? Tom, oh, Tom, yeah, when did you yeah, first yeah, play Tom, the Tom, game? Please, yeah. God. Um. Oh God. So I first played Minecraft in 2014, hmm. and I I was fucking, playing all these fucking new fags. Jesus <laughs> Christ! Hey, I started so, in ten, so. So I. I, my, my, my friends uh, were like, yo, we're going to play Minecraft. Do you want to play with us? And I'm like, I've never played Minecraft in my life. And they're like, well, you need to fix that immediately. And I was like, uh, fuck. So they made me buy Minecraft for $20 when it was 20 bucks, which they sucked. They made you at fucking they knife point. Yeah, they're like, dude, you're you're being, we're going to stream, we're going to we're gonna play weekly, it's going to be a thing, it's going to be awesome, and you're going to be part mm. of it. I'm like, okay. So I started playing And those playing friends Minecraft. would go on to become the Yogg's cast. If yes. only. Ex yes. Exactly. Oh, okay. oh, they, they wanted to get you in, Tom, but you're like, no, I don't see a future in this. I don't think this is going to go anywhere. And they're yeah. like, well, suit yourself, dude. My, my, my business savvy continues to be impeccable. 
Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But no, so we were going to play, and, and I, I was very confused when I started playing the game, because I'm like, why is everything so confusing? Like, why does everything look so shit? And they're just like, no, that's like... They're like, that's it's like just not est- even real life. Like, what the hell? Yeah, what are these yeah. pixels? This is they're like, They're like, no, dude, that's the aesthetic. I'm like, but like, there's like these weird, just like everything's so patchy and weird i don't understand and 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 we were playing for like two hours and i was just very confused we learned to find out later that there was like a glitch with my computer and like half the textures weren't displaying and that's why i was so utterly bamboozled as to why everything looked because i knew it was supposed to look shit but i'm like is it supposed to look this shit like half the (laughs) textures just weren't loading so they're just like you just have to combine these two things and i'm just like but they look the same and they're like what are you retarded i'm like (laughs) i guess so that was my one and only experience with Minecraft because I could never get it to work my computer and I haven't tried since. And I, I guess I still have a license floating around somewhere, but I don't mm-hmm. even know how I would what, access it at what this point. What kind right. of computer do you have where you can't fucking no, run no. Minecraft? Well, that's the thing. The computer was a quad-core i7, a GeForce GTX like uh, 650 at the time, like 16 gigs of RAM. It should have crushed Minecraft, but no, it was not meant to be. How well, there you go. Bizarre. That was fake. Nate, was... remember, re- remember when we got into Terraria for a little while there? Terraria, oh, Terraria is okay. Okay, Terraria, Terraria, is, Terraria is like Minecraft, Minecraft, but just better. Well, literally. there you go. That's yeah, there you go. Free. There you go. Better <laughs> yeah. and, and not and, and actually nine ninety nine. Uh, but, but uh, we, I'll just we, say, we, let's just let's just do the Terraria real quick. Uh, Terraria is just 2D, and it's more fun to play. At least it was the vanilla It's Terraria. more of a game. It, it, game. It, that's what like I'm trying it. to say. That's what I'm trying to say. It's more of a game, God. but that's fine. Okay, Whatever. We, 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 let's get into Terraria more later. I don't like about, it. About, Wait, like, do we hear Gib? Do we hear about Gib's yeah, origins? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, um, yeah. I saw Minecraft over my little brother's shoulder. He was playing the alpha, mm-hmm. and he was putting cobblestone blocks around, and I was like, what's that? And he says, it's Minecraft. You should get it. It's really fun. You can build, and I'm like, oh, okay, yeah. Look, you know, brushing it off because you know my little brother is mm. playing it. Therefore, mm. it must be gay. So I'm not <laughs> gonna get into this. Um, then I continue to see it, and I'm like, you know what? That looks pretty fun. And I could hear the the Minecraft music because that was that was a, from an era where people, you know, they still just listen to the music in the game. And uh, I I got it in the beta. And I played it forever, and uh, I love it, and it's my favorite thing, and I still love it. And um, my biggest, my biggest uh, like Minecraft YouTube thing was always X's Adventures in Minecraft. That really got me into. Like, oh, do you, do you me remember too. that? Me too. Me <laughs> that, fucking what, too, what dude. I remember X Base. I remember fucking X's Adventure. I love fucking X's, X's Adventures Adventure. in Minecraft. I, I had already been following him because he made, oh like, World of Warcraft, God. like, how to tank videos, and I was like, I need to know that. And I just liked the way he talked and his voice. And then his Minecraft series started, and I was like, you know, he was in there on the, on the ground floor, but he, he, he sort of didn't blow up because of Minecraft, unfortunately. But uh, his, like, journey through exploring Minecraft in the early days and figuring stuff out and building his base... It was, uh, it is my favorite. It's hey, I so just want to, uh, sorry to interrupt, I just want to let you know, I just paid for, I've been stealing Minecraft for a very long time. Before this stream, I decided I would finally buy it. I have just logged into 2B2T for the very first time. Oh, and no. looking around at this gigantic hellscape, and <laughs> it is, I see swastikas, I see uh, <laughs> racial should, should, slurs. Should we transition now? Should, 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 <laughs> should Fit give us the rundown of 2B2T? Well, because, well like, I, let's I, take a I, little... I, 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 I feel I feel like 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 we all we, we, we can all get into the the nitty gritty of like of like what yeah. we like about Minecraft. I think it's time to transition over to Minecraft server because that's where I spent the bulk of my. It's time, time. to transition to Minecraft. We've been waiting yeah, for this yeah, for a yeah. while. It's really <laughs> time. Mine, yeah, yeah. I, I, th- yeah. I think all of us can agree that Minecraft servers is where we spent most of our time. I'm not I'm not gonna play some fucking mm-hmm. shitty ass single player game. I, I the love the single player of Minecraft. There's a single player. It is so game? fun. <laughs> What yeah, the but, fuck? But, 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 but multiplayer yeah. is obviously where to go, and servers are fucking great. I spend most of my time. And there's very one particular server that my friend Mark showed me many moons ago called Two Builders Two Tools dot org, and mm-hmm. that's why I found this boy here, Finemcy. Finemcy, I think you are like a professor. You're like you have like a PhD in this server. Mm-hmm. So yes. please, please explain it to us uh, in in the way that you do. Okay. Well, if you know, there's any listeners that are not too familiar with Minecraft. Basically, 90% of players, if you play through single player, you're going to have the same kind of experience. You're going to build a base, make some food for yourself, and then eventually kill the dragon. Like, that's Mm, 90% mm. of single player for most people. But when you get to multiplayer servers, there's a, uh, no pun intended, there's a huge spectrum 
of different uh, <laughs> multiplayer servers you can play on. On the one hand, you've got like the kid friendly mini game servers where you're like playing with your friends and talking about it the next day at school. And then you've got <laughs> my side. All yeah, right. yeah. The side that the big is boy actually the heavier really side of the spectrum, up. if you yeah. will. So, for those of you that don't know, Two Builders Two t- uh, Tools or Two B Two T dot org is the oldest anarchy server in Minecraft, and I believe the second oldest server overall. And it's hmm. holy shit. It's a server that is no rules, which means you can hack, you can cheat, you can steal. There's no censorship. There's no admins at all. It's just survival Minecraft, but <laughs> the map is like almost eight years old at this point, and it is just insane. Well, uh, hey, I've got a, I've got a question, Fit. I mean, okay, so if that's the case, how did they make money off of it? I mean, we got how someone's got to be. If there's no profit motive, why would anyone ever be interested in doing anything? I don't understand. <laughs> Please explain. Please explain. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, for the first few years of the server, I mean, it was a very small server. I'd say the most players that ever had, like, as an active player base was about 100. And -hmm. the entire server ran off player donations. The admin of 2B2T, his name is Housemaster. He's this really mysterious guy that no one really knows much about except that he's from ne- never intervenes and it, it, it only will do it on the most extreme circumstances he's just this like like bizarre shadow figure that like like i i don't like how many people have ever even seen him like like in like in the world i have i've seen a like a small leaked picture of him and that's about yeah. it like it's yeah. Just, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just a picture of gray he's yeah. just like he, he's like bigfoot you know, uh, I'm sorry to interrupt again, but I'm just, I am currently exploring 2B2T for the first time here. I've walked up to a sky bridge, and there is just a towering wall of lava as far as the eye can see oh, on either yeah. side. Mm-hmm. That's just, it's impenetrable. I, I have to go back. I have to kill myself. Fascinating. You're going Fascinating. through the uh, stereotypical first night on 2B2T. You're a new player. Yeah. I guarantee you, just wait a couple minutes. Someone will be by in diamond armor. Running a hundred miles an hour. And like, yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to get demolished instantly. I really look forward to it. Yeah. Oh, you're, it you're, sounds you're, great. Nate, I want you. It needs to sink in for you. You yeah. are not playing against like the best Minecraft server. Like you know, you, you don't like they have diamond diamond armor fully mm-hmm. enchanted. Like that's not the problem here. The problem <laughs> is speed hacks and like like one oh, okay. kills and like running across the map at like insane speeds where you can't even fucking process them. Oh, and when you go into the Nether. Like, 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 people will just be like running up to you with fucking beds, placing them well, and sleeping, and, ex- and like just blowing you up instantaneously. Well, l- listen, Munchie, I'm sure, I'm sure that's gonna be really effective, but I've got my own life hack right here. <laughs> oh, the steak weed, bro! I'm gonna fucking blitz the fuck out. Nobody can keep up with me. Okay, that's that's the, my joke. I do the, weed. The, the, the only way joke. to like oh. see speed hacks properly is to smoke <laughs> weed. That's the only way to oh, combat. Slow them. down time. That's right. That's right. By, by, by the viewers, I I, I, I get this. In, I, I've explained to be two T to many people before, and they've seen less than press than they should be. So so I I just want to hammer this home for 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 the normies in the audience. You may be thinking, what's the deal? You know, eight years? That's fine. I'm more than eight years old. That's fine. Okay, but you have to you have to understand this. Minecraft is a game where you can like you can destroy and can you can build anything. You have complete like te- control to like terraform your reality. And because it's no rules, you can terraform anything. So just imagine the abuse that these 4chan mm. freaks and mm. geeks have done to not just the spawn area. The spawn area's got the worst, obviously. But just, like, for millions upon millions of block outwards from spawn, the amount of griefing and, like, dynamite and just fucking unholy concoctions these people have made over the course of <laughs> eight fucking years. It's fucking unbelievable there are entire there the, my favorite thing about about fucking 2b2 team is because it's obviously like a cruel wasteland where where you'll 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 get fucking sodomized for asking for a nickel and that's just the way things are <laughs> 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 oh god i got to the top of the staircase and there was an intentional hole fuck oh i know dude okay. exactly exactly uh, wow. but but, the, but but my favorite thing is like 
th- there are people dedicated to just helping out new fags, and 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 the and the two things that that, that are the most evident of that are uh, uh, near spawn. There are just like patches of watermelon you can pick up because, because watermelons are the new fag food. Hmm. And, hmm. and 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 my favorite thing are the never highways. There there are near the top of the ceiling of uh, in the nether. There are just like 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 two by two hallways that stretch out for like thousands upon thousands of millions of blocks that stretch out farther than you could ever like hope to walk in a single se- uh, s- uh, you know session and they will help you get away from spawn as fast as you humanly can and those are like maintained like there's there are people who like intentionally like you know try and keep up the appearance of those and, and try and fix them when people try and destroy them it, it's great it's gr- it's a great community it's it's totally incredible. this is yeah i mean yeah. we even have it to the point where each cardinal direction if you're on the nether highway it goes to the world border Millions. Oh my! Oh my God! I remember. I, I, I haven't played in a while, but I remember they were working that when I uh, when I got this. Up. This is fascinating to me. Like I'm not super interested in Minecraft as a game per se. I it just it hasn't. Maybe I just haven't tried it enough. You know, with like working graphics. But like just the concept of there's a decade of just like culture and society and just like like oh, custom built the around culture. like yeah. like. A, a virtual space and how it's just like slowly evolving and the fact that like it's being done because it's, it's different than something like world of warcraft where like you know people have been playing forever but like that's like a static world where like this is just like everything is entirely user generated and like susceptible to be destroyed at a moment's notice and there's just like this undercurrent of just like some like underlying knowledge that like the people who've been there forever <clears> just kind <throat> of understand it blows my mind it's so cool i just want to like well, you listen know, to it forever when i first heard about it it really reminded i haven't like looked into this either but like eve online as i understand it yeah. has a completely organically generated like gigantic factional system divided between like two huge organizations uh and that's just such a fascinating thing that that can exist in these virtual spaces we've created and people like really give a shit about it and adhere to it and and have these kind of in groups that are completely separate from the real world they're only virtual uh dope uh, fucking dope fit fit i have a question how do you feel what's what are your thoughts on dwarf fortress Oh man, I have never actually played it, but I've seen it being played, and I'm just like, this yeah. game is not for yeah. me. I can't. Um, it's like fun <laughs> losing, same. right? That's the motto. Like it's fun. <laughs> yeah, to losing lose. is fun. Losing hmm. is fun. Hmm. I I mean, I'm I'm not great at Dwarf Fortress, but I've played I've played some of it. And um, all right, so uh, so since Munchie introduced me to your channel uh, this mm-hmm. past a little while ago i've i've you know i've listened to a bunch of your videos i especially like the ones that go into like you know like the history and the lore of the mm-hmm. server and stuff and and listening to like listening to like an account of like how like you know the war is played out or you know how the, all these different like characters or, or people had effects on the, of the culture or whatever it reminds me of something that i really like about dwarf fortress which i like even more than playing it like I, I really like um, listening to or like reading like like stories of like how like a world played out and like how a a, a, a dwarven society fell. Just like a, a procedurally generated like story of like a world and and stuff and well, like the like a blow by blow of like how things as how things progressed in like a bizarre way. Now uh, yeah. I, I don't don't take this the wrong way, but bit. To be to whatever the fuck this thing is name is, I keep fucking up. Is literally the Dark Souls of Minecraft. And <laughs> it, it is. Well, I'm sure that a lot of servers are like that. But like, as I was watching your lore videos, I just kept thinking that this world is exactly like what a Dark Souls setting is like. It's like a ruined world where there are pockets of civilization that still exist and you can seek them out and find them. And basically the fun of it is like exploring the lore and finding out what transpired here to make the world into the twisted shell of itself that it is now. And you're basically the Vadi Vidya of B2BT. Uh, fu- whatever the fuck well, it is. It's not hard. What is the it's name of the letters. server? I don't know any of those. Okay, well... Uh, point is, it's fucking awesome, and uh, it's super cool, and it is yeah. Dark Souls, and I like Dark Souls. Please, I implore you, all check out Fitz's channels. Uh, he has a bunch of playlists. He doesn't just do 2B2T. He, he, he does, you know, he does other stuff now. But uh, the, how I got into him, and I think a lot of people did, was mm-hmm. 2B2T, and they're fucking iconic videos. I especially love my 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 my, my absolute favorite is of course the uh, the Pop Bob uh, video and the uh, the 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 Valley of Wheat video. I, I like the history of, of the super weapons. Those that was definitely my, my favorite by far of the ones I watched was uh, the finally reaching the border wall. That video legitimately brought me to tears 
it, because Shit, it was so I'm emotional seeing. and like seeing all these people because like okay guys just so you understand it is over four million blocks or something it might have been four in the ether to get all the way into the 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 final border of of the server and to get there requires a month months long real world investment of every day walking there with the, with all the most biggest enhancements for speeds you can get and when you finally get there and there's all these people waiting for you specifically fit to have a celebration about you this guy that they like love and respect all these people were willing to put in all this work to get all the way out there in order to have a fucking party for you at this landmark event of you reaching the border wall that was like Brotherhood. It's fucking brotherhood is what that Nate, is. Nate, you it know, that, that's, gonna be, that's gonna be every single day for Mexicans when they reach the border wall. <laughs> brotherhood. Themselves. Walking across, you know, the Yucatan so that's, that's what they're gonna have every Incredible. single day. Incredible. Incredible. Uh, Absolute. Yes. Absolutely. Just another, re just another great reason to build that wall. Just another yeah. great one. So, so yeah. that they can have that emotional fulfillment when exactly. they finally reach it. We, yeah. we want to be able to let them nether orb hack past the border wall temporarily <laughs> and, and unlock their camera and see what's going on on the other side of that wall you know why rob them of the joy we can't fucking, we can't do it fucking kino yeah so so, <laughs> so i i mean i i think i'm the only one here besides nate very recently who's actually played on 2p2t mm -hmm. and uh i i found out about it through, through a friend and uh we like 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 here's how the 2p2t experience has gone for me whereas like I'll, I'll join spawn i'll immediately be like like, 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 I'll have, like, whiplash, because this is unlike any other Minecraft server I've ever been in. <laughs> like, you know, you'll, you'll have that pussy shit where, like, spawn is, like, made out of obsidian, or, or you know, like, like, hard code in where you can't destroy spawn. Mm. This, you spawn in some, like, random fucking, uh, like, cobblestone tower, like, 50 feet into the fucking sky. With like lava surrounding you on all sides, and then it like like if you're lucky, like I was, your friend will show up and it, it is fucking fully enchanted diamond armor, like like <laughs> on his horse, and be like, hey, like like I I've come to get you. We have to get out of here fast. I've brought you watermelon. We have to run before they get us. <laughs> so so like running through the night in this like fucking war torn countryside, you have to like search for the nearest nether portal. Like like hopefully your friend has uh, brought flint and like and like get it as fast as you can. You have to evade all these fucking bed bombing terrorists, like 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 run a thousand miles in this in this fucking scorched hellhole, and and, and 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 like hopping between nether portals so you can like raid various bases on your way there so you can get supplies because God knows like like he doesn't have the su supplies that can carry two people, and, and and finally you get you finally you get to the base and his base like was like built on top of this like like how to describe it? like 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 a, a chunk loading wrong so it was just like ocean and then like very Hmm. Like like hardly cut, just there was earth now, like 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 low ch uh, a chunk loading error. And it was mm -hmm. being like a giant like like Jerusalem like like cathedral type building. <laughs> it was fucking insane. It was absolutely fucking insane. And and oh my god, the feeling that you get, the feeling that you get when you fucking when you see another player tag and you can't tell who it is yet and oh you, you just don't know. know it's friend or foe yeah, yeah. you just yeah. know someone's there and you instantly crouch but even it doesn't even matter because they all have like like tag like trackers so you can obviously tell where you are but you just instantly crouch and you start to sweat in real life and fear <laughs> for your minecraft possessions more than you've ever feared for your real life possessions <laughs> in your entire fucking life this sounds it's, fun it's we should we should definitely do like a procrastinators like all go on the server at once oh, and try well, to and survive that, 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 that's a slippery slope hippo that that's how you that's how you get a a, a new fag invasion that's how you get that's a, true that's that, true that, 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 that's how that's how you pollute and you know cancerize the society that's a slippery slope well, well, I guess I mean, there's an argument to be made that, uh, not to be mean or anything, but I suppose you probably get a lot of detractors, you know, of the hardcore people, which I, I can sympathize with, who aren't too fond of you popularizing uh, fun, uh, you know, like servers that they, they don't so much want the new fags to be exploring. But, you know, you're a historian, as, as I see it. And so everything you've done is like a, a chronicling of the, of the events here. So, I mean, wh how do you deal with that? Wh what do you say to people who, who criticize you for that, if you even get that? Well, it's, you know, it's totally understandable because 2B2T was born from 4chan culture, which is very mm. anti-anything popular. Yeah. So secret club. A lot secret of, club yeah, it's like a secret club. So when a lot of players come <laughs> on, they try and act cool by saying like, oh, I hate YouTubers. I hate this, blah, blah, blah. But at the yeah. end of the day, whenever a YouTuber does invade, kind of like what's going on right now, it's mm -hmm. some of the most fun us old players have just by going to spawn and killing all these new players. 
Makes sense. Uh, yeah. Munchie was talking about bed bombing earlier, if you don't yes. know. Yes. So basically, <laughs> in normal Minecraft, you fight with a sword and a shield and a bow. <laughs> On 2v2T, mm -hmm. you fight with beds and end crystals. Mm. Because yeah. since Jesus everyone fuck. is walking around in full Protection 4 armor, stacked, and also they have what's called a Totem of Undying, which is like a... Like a fairy in a bottle from Zelda, if you die, mm -hmm. it brings you back to life. The only way to kill someone is to blow up a bed or a crystal next to them and just deplete their totems until they are fully out. It's just... <laughs> it's... I still have PTSD uh. from the war of all these explosions going on around me. I know. And it's like whenever <laughs> like an eight-year-old comes up to me to start talking about Minecraft, like, I like pigs and stuff... I just started thinking of my time in the trenches and all those explosions <laughs> going off. The like, bed bombs Kid, going off left and right. Yeah. You haven't seen the shit that I've seen. Have you, have you been able to sleep in a bed after that? <laughs> <laughs> he exclusively can sleep in race car beds because he has yeah. no negative associations with those. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. It, 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 it's... I... I Oh my god, there, there are so many times where, like, like I, I've seen someone race by in the nether, and I knew that, like, like my time was numbered, and I had to <laughs> reach fucking safety immediately. <laughs> or, like, god like, damn. You, oh my god, like, I'm, like, because the nether highways are such, like, tight corridors, it, like, you, it'll just be, like, you know, you'll just see an intersection up ahead, but, like, it'll be too, like, like, you know, uh, you can't properly see it so just mm -hmm. imagine you're walking down this tight corridor there's an intersection coming up you just see this guy with no diamond armor on just like don't even fucking care about it running at full speed you see his tracker come up and like immediately disappear over the horizon and then like and then you like see him stop and like look back at you and then you know you're about to start a great chase unlike any fucking other well Where well hey listen listen yeah. minecraft's yeah. all fun and games but it's time to get to the most important question here how exactly is my Minecraft helping us make Starfleet real. Like what? Oh, what? What are, we, what, are we, what are we? What are we doing Nate, here? What are Nate, we doing? Nate, Nate, throw it in the garbage. Yeah, you can fuck up. <laughs> I just want to model the Enterprise. As, this was, uh, this is such a, this such a good episode. Don't worry. Do you remember that that one guy who uh -huh. like built a one to one of like the Starship Enterprise? I've in seen Minecraft? that. Yeah, yeah. And, and then in Professor and then Inspector Gadget made fun of him on on that Mike Mateus. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I remember that. How well, fucking terrifying. Fit, fit, fit. Yeah. I want to know, because, because my, my first base was this, like, watermelon castle thing I made. What was your first base you made in 2B2D? Um, it was a dirt hut, because I was surviving <laughs> on zombie flesh. And this was back in 2013, and then I think I made, like, a little fishing hut next to a river, and then I walked a 100,000 blocks overworld just to get established. Oh, why Goddamn. overworld? <laughs> Because, you know, when you're a noob and you're not familiar with, like, the nether and stuff, because when you're brand new, you don't know about the nether highways, you don't know mm -hmm. where all the little secret shortcuts are that lets you get in and out, like, mm -hmm. so that's just, you get that from just years of experience and sort of, mm -hmm. like, mentally mapping out where things are on the server. Mm -hmm. okay. Is there, like, um, is there, like, like a, if one Minecraft block is one <coughs> meter, is, how, like, big is this, this server? Like, in terms of, like, real world. Oh, dimensions. okay. So, well, first of all, to, to give you a real idea of how big this server is, I want to talk about how much disk space it takes up. Most yeah. Minecraft um, yeah. worlds, no. if you plan it for a long time, it's probably going to be measured in gigabytes. Like, my original Minecraft world that I still have that I play on is about four gigabytes. Mm -hmm. 2B2T is measured in terabytes. <laughs> all right. It all is, right. It's been played on by, I think... 200,000 players at least once hmm. and um, it's just like I said the, the highways go all the way to the world border and the nether some players have walked millions of blocks overworld and it's just all this Christ. terrain has been generated and what you can do is because it's such an old server whenever Minecraft updates to add like new biomes and stuff there's these violent chunk borders when you go from one Minecraft version to another, and then right. following yeah, these yeah, chunk so borders, true. you can walk out hundreds of thousands of blocks to find people's bases. It's crazy. Yeah, damn. Man. 
it, it, it's not like it's not like those like those like like thirty million blocks or whatever are, are are like uninhabited. Like you know, after you get to a certain point, like oh, there's just no civilization out there. Like like the like the like the top tier players. Um, oh, I'm forgetting there, there was a, there was a giant city with like a, a bunch of like pro top tier players. I'm forgetting what it was that Jared found legendarily. Oh, imps, uh, yeah. Yeah, imps, imps, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that like that was like like millions of blocks out. Like they're like. No matter where you go on the server, there will be someone who has tread before you. And and that just makes it even more interesting because you can always find just little relics of, like, someone being there or, or like, a, like, a block misplaced or something. Oh, th- th- this is the scariest 2B2... Oh, I, I, actually, did you want to answer... Do you, do you know off the top of your head how big it is in real life, Fit, 2B2T? Um, well, assuming, um... Well, a Minecraft world, I think, isn't it at its biggest? It's, like, 60 million by 60 million blocks. I think mm. so. Yeah, so just honestly, 60 million by 60 million is what it is because there are players that have generated those chunks all the way out to the world border. Hypothetically, mm-hmm. yeah, so. I Fucking don't know. crazy. It's nuts, uh, man. But the, the scariest moment that I had in 2B2T was I had not played for a while. You know, I, I just like left, you know, my base there. You know, I, 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 I had not played for like a month or two. Then I join back. I walk go like, I, you know, I walk outside. And there's a sign left by someone like, like, hello, it's me, so-and-so. Found this deserted base, just took what I could. Uh, nice, nice-looking base here. You know, I, I left on this date. And, like, I don't even know how to it, but, like, 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 imagine coming home to your house and, like, all of your furniture is just, like, slightly shifted and you know that someone's been there and they haven't done anything malicious. You just know it's out of place. That's what I felt. This person, this person, like, invade my Minecraft base, like, thinking it was deserted. Like, they didn't blow it up or anything. They, they just came in, they, like, like took some of my diamonds and shit, which was fine. That's just, you know, the name of the game. But it was just so fucking terrifying knowing that, like, I could have been logged in and, like, he could have easily killed me, probably. Because I'm shit. Like, like I nearly avoided death by like playing dead and like and like him <laughs> thinking this was a good place. Like, well like, done, th- th- dude. Like, like, yeah. Hey, hey, I, I just did a quick calculation. I looked online. Apparently, a Minecraft block is one meter. Is one meter is the cannon distance? So sixty million meters uh, is equal to uh, thirty-seven thousand miles. So I guess you could say that it's roughly uh, like thirty-seven. Hey, fuck. Let me do the fucking math here. This times this fucking times this. It is one, wait, one billion, wait, fuck. I gotta count the fucking places here. Okay, one trillion, three hundred and eighty-nine billion, nine hundred sixty-seven, seven hundred and seventy square feet. Jesus. Wait, 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 wait. You said that it's, um, well, the earth, the earth's surface area is almost 200 million square miles. Okay, well, this is in, wait, this was in miles? Fuck. That was in feet. I don't fucking know. Whatever. Hold on, hold on. It's really big. Guys. It's, really it's really big. Really big. <laughs> I'm, I'm figuring this out. Everyone, continue. In like okay. five minutes, I'll jump in with a, with some factoids that no one cares about anymore. <laughs> some, some mad facts. Yo, let's talk yeah. about how else this game is literally Dark Souls. Uh, how about uh, how cool it is? That's pretty Dark Souls, right? <laughs> thank, thank you. Right. Uh, uh, that's what, that's my contribution. Yeah. There you go. Speaking speaking of loading chunks, I remember on um, um, like like a month or I two prefer before blowing I... chunks if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> dab dab dab. Go on. <laughs> but before I left, like a month or two, th- th- there was an elytra hack going on where this guy was like like staying in air with the elytra perpetually, and he was going so fast that he was constantly loading chunks, and so the server would oh. have to like lag in order to accommodate him loading new chunks, like creating new, like you know, generating new land and so the, the server was always on like one or two ticks because there was just like like one or two guys just flying around at like 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 fucking like sonic speeds like breaking the sound barrier in their fucking wings creating new land to inhabit it, it was a fucking nightmare it was really incredible they're, they're also oh my god lag Lag is so fucking integral to the history of 2B2T. <laughs> People are always trying to make, like, 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 the newest and best lag machines in order to crash the servers. Yeah. Fit, you, you made a pretty good fit, uh, a lag machine. Or were you, were you showcasing? I remember there was a video where you were showing off a lag machine. I think you were at, um, um, Oftopia's base, maybe? You, yeah, you, you yeah. At, yeah, yeah. And what's crazy is when you come across, the, like, the ruins of a lag machine, like, on yeah. 2B2T, hmm. people consider that like an actual relic, like, whoa, this used to crash the server, and now it's in ruins, and it's got vines growing on it. Like, yeah. It's just this weird pseudo, like, 
lore thing going on. I don't know. It's just it's so hard to describe two v two t to fucking normies. It's just yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I have done I, it. I, I, I have oh, done it. The, sur- it okay. the, the surface area of the Earth is one hundred and ninety six million square miles. The surface area of this Minecraft server is one hundred and thirty eight million square miles so it is smaller than the earth but not by that much okay all right it's like 70 percent do you remember that earth? like most of the earth is covered in water so well, well yeah, so, so water. it's pro- yeah it's probably how much of it that? Yeah. most of it oh, <laughs> oh, okay uh, I, 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 was gib gonna say to yeah, be, yeah, yeah yeah i find what? it to be really cute uh that there were vines growing on it because that because vines <laughs> don't just grow on stuff Somebody has to place they, them there. They, somebody has to like I put think, them. Oh, there somebody was say, like, "Ooh, I want to make these look li- really rustic. I want to really make this yeah. thing look rustic." Uh, yeah, that's cool. That is very possible. But I think they do grow on the south, but now I, I could be wrong. Do uh, they? they do spread to a degree, and mm. if they're hanging, like they will drop all the way down to whatever block yeah. they yeah. need. So, like at spawn, mm. you've got vines at sky limit growing all the way down to yeah. bedrock. <laughs> <laughs> it fit. I think I said my favorite my favorite story because these really are like like Bible esque parables that you have of like legendary <laughs> figures like li- like they're they're like larger than life. I, I, my favorite is, is Jang in the Valley of Wheat. That's just like that's like literally a Bible story where like you know like 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 this guy meets another guy in the Nether and, and they like found like a city together. It, Damn. It, 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 please go watch the, the Jang in the Valley of Wheat uh fucking story uh in, on Fit's channel. What is your favorite story from Two B Two T Fit? My favorite story. Oh man, I don't know. There's, I know there's, there's so many. There's so many, <laughs> and it's just oh man. I honestly can't give you an answer right now because there's just so much, and I have to like think back. Because I've just mm-hmm. put out so mm-hmm. much to be content and just been on the server for so many years, I don't know. How about just a good one that's that, that's on well, the top of your head? Uh, yeah. I've got a or, thing. What's, okay. the, what's the most like tragic story you can think of? Oh, All right. Ooh, Every that's a good story one. Is a tragic story this, on this fucking server. I'm gonna yeah. open the old player vault for this one. There was a player that joined 2B2T a long time ago, and this player name was his. It was Chris Lighton, mm. and he kept oh, going around the server telling people, I'm the king of 2B2T. You mad? <laughs> and he would just scam it. <laughs> well, okay, okay. turns out, Chris Lighton <laughs> used his real name as his oh. Minecraft username. Oh. And so he was got so hard that he never returned to 2B2T. Oh. And uh, it's oh. just... That's the thing about 2B2T. It is a very toxic place. I mean, people have, like, mm-hmm. fucked with each other in real life over a block game. Like, it gets intense. Mm-hmm. If you join and you have, like, any sort of trace to your real-world identity, <clears throat> you're fucked. Damn. I guess they really were mad, after yeah. all. <laughs> 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 oh god! Oh, oh! I, th- th- this isn't on your channel, Fit. Um, but I, if I, 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 my favorite, my favorite piece of like overall content that you, that you have that you have produced was a, a dramatic reading you did of a conversation between Pop Bob and Jared, uh, two thousand thirteen. Um, oh yeah. Where, where they just insult each other back and forth. Yeah. Oh man! So. Uh, it's, yeah. Please yeah. Please. It's hard to like explain this to outsiders who don't know these people, but. 2B2T, before it got, like, quote-unquote, internet famous, was mm. just home to degenerates. Like, you, <laughs> you either played on it because you had a sick curiosity like I did, or it became your life if you had no life. And the way these players would talk to each other, just saying the most vile, fucked-up shit to each other and doxing each other, it was just... It's not like the PCP in that way. Yeah, it's from the <laughs> sidelines, it was very amusing. It was very amusing to watch. Mm. It was great. And and, and 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 okay okay. That's the four chain community pa, pa, for you. And, yeah. and so so there's two people, Pop Bob and Jerry 2013. Uh, Pop Bob was like this like like infamous like 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 the fucking griefer. Like like Pop Bob's <laughs> name is still like fucking like rings throughout the cosmos as the griefer. He, he had a lightning hack where he can like you know like like understand where you are when lightning struck. It Jeez. was fucking it, it it was insane and. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna show a little bit of my naivete. Uh, from what I can understand, I have not looked into this person as much. But Jared 2013, from what I can tell, is just like a huge asshole memer. <laughs> Sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's just a fucking meme who like 
who's just like yeah he's just a memer he, he did some important stuff but like basically like i don't think about him as like a real person he's just a huge meme uh which is fine <laughs> and great but yeah the, him and and pop bob had this like legendary conversation when line says go sniff paint you brain dead kike i really <laughs> like that one <laughs> It's it's just it's just fucking great. I mean, I I could stay here reminiscing about all these fucking great times forever. Yeah. They're, they're, like the problem with two B two D is it's just so fucking big. You can't talk about it in any like you know reasonable way. Like we have not scratched the surface. We've talked about like maybe like six stories here. Like that's literally nothing. That is literally nothing. There are countless stories that you could make. You could be. To be too famous, if if you really try to, you have the autonomy to do anything in this fucking game, and you could make a name for yourself if you really fucking. I mean, try. that's that's, that's cool the amazing thing. I just right now, just because I wanted to have a little experience of playing it, just bought Minecraft, even though I'd been resisting that for fucking years, uh, <laughs> and just jumped right into the server, and bam, there I am. It's real. It's it's real. The legends are all it. there. It, I've done even it. Even though your 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 contribution so far is probably like you know like I, fe- I ate on grass. shit and died is what yeah. I did. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, that's, that, Humble that, beginnings. Yeah. At, at the very least, Nate, you've added to that fucking terabyte, you know, file size. You are now a new player ID that the game has to there keep you track go. of. You are, there your you name go. is etched inside of there for fucking uh, ever now. What is it? Uh, Meme Boy Blue will live on forever in those annals. <laughs> Boy Blue. Meme Boy Blue. There he is. Uh, that's what's cool about 2B2T. That's what I like about all fucking multiplayer games. It's just the ability to, like, like, like with your friends, like, like I played 2B2T with, with your friends, to just be able to bond over doing shit in the game. D- video games, multiplayer video games, are literally like World War One, a.k.a. good. <laughs> there, <laughs> there is no greater way to bond with your fucking friends than having a, like, a common goal that unites you against an, adver- an adversary That's true. in order to fucking defeat it. That, that's, just, that's just common knowledge. That, that's, just, that's what you fucking do. You, and Watchmen enemy, was literally based on 2P2T in that respect. You know? That's Watchmen what it was about. Was, yeah, because yeah, ultimately they all unite against a fake opponent so that they wouldn't kill each other, you know? Having an external opponent is what unites people. Brings people together. Uh, yes, basically. Yeah. And, and that's why all all of my best friendships have been forged in fucking Minecraft or fucking, <laughs> you know, TF2, all that shit. It just, it just, it's the perfect... I honest to God believe this. It's like the perfect way to spend time with your friends. It, like like having like 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 a like an understandable like realized goal and like being able to talk about whatever you want just like in this pointed directed conversation. It's fucking beautiful. I love multiplayer games. I literally th- I I multiplayer games are better than single player games. That's a real thing that I actually think. But you can be with your fucking real ass friends and doing shit. I, I the moments I have playing fucking Terraria or TF2 or fucking you know CS:GO for a while, they're they're beautiful. They will never be taken away from me. I don't remember fucking mining coal and mine. I don't fucking care about that. I care about I care about finding old bases in 2B2T and destroying them completely. That's the kind of shit that I care about in games. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I, I, I want to know, like, like who, who, Ben, you are, you are now officially 30 years old. You are 30. Yes. Happy years birthday, As of today. Ben. Happy yeah. birthday. Yes. Splendid. Do, do, do you have any memories playing at online all, games? At all. At all. Or are they yeah, gone? Yeah, they're, they're, they're fading fast. Anything. They're fading <laughs> fast. Yeah. Like, like, Wait, do you, I have any memories of what now? Uh, of, like, playing online games with your friends? Because I get the impression that this is a fairly, like, new person you know, new age Gen Z thing to like want to spend time with your friends in video games. Well, um, the mm, the multiplayer game I probably played the most of was Team Fortress Two for a yeah. while. Yeah, yeah, but Fuck I didn't. Yeah. I didn't play it with friends. Like I didn't have know anyone else that okay. was playing it, well. so I fell off. Um, I don't know. Like I had friends that tried to get me into Minecraft, and I didn't stick to it. I had friends one summer in college when I was home. I. Yeah, I, I, I played World of Warcraft for one summer because it was, like, just the way to hang out with my friends. Um, so, yeah, and it was, and that was cool. Um, and then, so so that was, like, like playing through the, the game and, like, leveling up was fun. And then I got to the end, and, like, I hit max level, and it was, oh, time to start raiding. And I realized that I hate World of Warcraft, and I stopped playing it. But I didn't need it anymore, because <laughs> now... You realize that you I, hate it once you beat it, yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah. That, was, that was similar to my experience with uh, League of Legends. I just played it so I could stay in contact with my friends, uh, yeah. for the most part, yeah. Yeah, yeah I played um, yeah. I played with... Uh, friends, friends tried to get me into... Um, 
League of Legends as well, and I quickly realized that I just wanted none of it. I remember very well. Uh, you played Warwick, and then you yes. said, "Wait, there are other characters to learn besides Warwick." It's Trash. like it's not enough for me to just kind of get good at using Warwick. I have yeah, to like yeah. know them all. Fuck this. Mm -hmm. Understandable. <laughs> Understandable. I played. I played a little bit of Halo Two. That was my online mm. game back back in the day. Me and my buddies would play Halo Two because we played Halo One for a long time at my friend Mike's house, and we just played the same map, hang them high, pistols I... only. It was the fucking best. And then we moved pistols to Halo only. Two, and we played that all the fucking time. And I hated that I had to keep buying Xbox Live because I'm cheap as fuck. <laughs> I couldn't understand. I tried because I had like two groups of friends. I had, like, Curse my friends the Xbox. Like, I had my buddies, <laughs> no. my buddies from the comic book store. Because I used to play, like, cards and shit there all the time. And we would play Halo. And then my friends from, like, school would uh, play Counter-Strike. And I hated Counter-Strike because it was hard. And I don't like hard things because it was... I, my computer also sucked ass. I had to run it, like, at, like, lowest settings. So that was not fun. So I played Halo all the time. And I remember specifically my last time ever playing Halo 2 online. Because we were fucking garbage at halo 2 like to this day me and my buddy mike i just hung out with him yesterday um we were we're terrible at games and despite the fact that we would like to be good at games no matter how much effort and practice we put into it we never get better um and that's that hmm. started all the way back with halo 2 i remember the last day we both played halo 2 was when we were just just pubbing, being fucking retarded, trying to get good, uh, trying to maximize our rocket jumping in BXR and still couldn't do it correctly. <laughs> and then we just joined this random match and these two little kids oh, completely shit. dominated us. And they just get spoke fucked. they just spoke Spanish the whole time. Yeah, it was munchy. It was munchy. Exactly. And we had no yeah, idea yeah, what was yeah. going on. And from that, we were so shamed forever. We hung up our controllers <laughs> for the rest you know of what? time. It's good for a man to know when he's wasting his Place. fucking time. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Tom, I, I want to let you know that I have, like, PTSD when everyone, like, anyone even mentions the word halo. Like, the room fills with, like, ball <laughs> smell, and all I can smell is balls. Because the only person I ever played halo with was my cousin, who just always smelled like balls and whenever he would kill me because he wouldn't teach me how to play would just say ah sick you're shit over and over again. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was my you're only shit. experience with yeah, yeah. learned a lot from the him. word the word i would most associate with halo is is i like this kid just screams nate because my, my friend mike's brother nate? his nate <laughs> He, because he, he would throw grenades, but yell Nate really obnoxiously. Oh, Nate, less than grenade. As, okay, okay. He, it's supposed to be Nate, but he would say Nate because he's a fucking oh. idiot. And and <laughs> we 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 named him Window because because at one point he got so mad that we beat him and hang him high. He punched the window of the house and shattered it, and then ran outside. <laughs> oh my fucking god! Hell yeah, yeah. Window. <laughs> that so sounds like that... my fucking kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> he's a fucking monster, oh my dude. God. It was crazy. Oh my god, the fucking. Dueling your friends in Team Fortress 2 is the most sadistic <laughs> pleasure you can ever derive from your fucking life. It's worse than real life torture. I have concluded through my many like like uh, like duels that I've done in one. I have concluded that like like being your friend in Team Fortress 2 and them like screaming at the top of their lungs trying to fucking kill you mm -hmm. is like the worst thing you can possibly do to another living being. Oh I, like like no matter the friend, no matter if your friend is short tempered or not, in Team Fortress 2 there's just something about about it where they will just try so fucking hard to kill you with all their might like like you know new friends old friends doesn't yeah. matter yeah. all will fucking scream at you in team fortress 2 duels it's oh, not yeah. like a similar experiences fit tf2 is just nuts i mean i am not one that is quick to violence but when you hear that, <laughs> when you hear that domination jingle and then someone <laughs> congas over your dead body it's really hard to just stay calm. Mm -hmm. You know, <laughs> my I've never been able to do that. I always rage quit every FPS, I every hate single TVPs. one. My my friends, I, I forget what game we were playing. It was some game of, along these lines. Uh, and so, like the match won, the match was over, and like one of my friends won, and one of my friends lost. Um, and like 
the one who, uh, like, so everything was, like, perfectly calm, like, uncomfortably calm after this, like, victory of one and the loss of the other. And that just kind of went on for a minute or two until, like, a, a discussion began about whether or not it was more cold-blooded to be, like, an up-close-and-personal, like, soldier who has to kill soldiers, like, close to him, or if it's more cold-blooded to be a sniper. And this discussion... What's more cold-blooded? What's more cold-blooded? This discussion has gone down the annals of my friendship history as one of the most climactic and earth-shattering moments uh, of all time. And, I'm and you sure know, the you two... you must have concluded that, that snipers are pussies. You must have concluded that, yes. Well, that they're like, well, that they're like the more... Okay, see, one of the... The, the friend who won kept saying like, nah, dude, it's way more bass. Like, get up close and personal and like fucking just shoot him right there. But the other friend who had lost, like, slowly but began to emerge with this deep, burning rage. That, like, it's obviously going to be the sniper because he has to, like, study him and, like, learn about him and, like, know his family and friends and, like, intimately get intimate with him. So, obviously, he's the one that's more cold-blooded. You stupid motherfucker, it's obviously the sniper if you're up you're killing a million people all your friends are dying you're gonna be your anxiety is gonna be so high you have to be the snipers obviously the one who's more fucking cold-blooded and then he like kicked the wall and like broke a lamp and ran away not one, <laughs> not, not, not one like which is cooler or more honorable no cold yeah it was cold-blooded who was more cold-blooded that's right, that's right. Look, these are serious questions clearly God. yeah yeah, I, but it it, it I, all derived that the, the rage there obviously derived from the game. I think it might have been League of Legends or something. I can't remember. I I I I still I said this before about how mm. like I I have met all of my like good friends over like Team Fortress Two or Minecraft, mm. and, and I remember I remember the first time that I met like like a lifelong friend that I still talk to to this day. I met him on an Australian furry server that I that I had just like randomly joined, and he and randomly. then another person I know. Yeah, and randomly. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, they they were both like arguing about like about like the twenty like twelve presidential election. Like oh. at the top of the lines, like all the furry admins were like telling them to stop, <laughs> but they just wouldn't because they knew that they made them angry. Uh huh. And uh, it was great, and and and, and, that, and that's why I met. I I've I've I there's just. It's beautiful. V multiplayer video games are just fucking beautiful <laughs> because all the things that you can do and all the things that you can be. That's why you come to the Oasis. It, you know, that, that's why people stay in, in this Steven Spielberg uh, yeah, uh, hellhole. Yeah. In terms it's, of, it's like, incredible. MMOs, I used to play a, a shit ton of MMOs, uh, but, like, RPG MMOs are MMORPGs, like, mostly fantasy ones. I, I would hop from one to another, like, within a month or so. Hmm. I played, like, I probably played... All of the old uh, MMORPGs that are out there still. Um, a few have even, even closed. I think uh, City of Heroes used to be a really good one. It's not a fantasy one. It was a hero one that was like the best game really ever. But they closed it. I'm so sad. And another one was um, Shin Megami Tensei Imagine, which was based on the Shin Megami Tensei series. Oh, they made an did... MMO of that? Is that an official oh, one? Yeah, yeah, it was. Oh, and hmm. like, uh, they, they changed publishers at some point as well. And I didn't even know about the Shin Megami Tensei series when I got into the game. Everything hmm. was like completely new to me. And it was like, it was amazing. I loved it. And then they closed it as well. And it was like sad. What, what was Rest that game? Didn't, didn't like we all play some game with you one time? Like oh, we all yeah. got... We all got in some MMO. And Whatever like, many yeah. MMO journeys, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Eden Eternal, I'm pretty sure that one was. It was really cute. Eden Eternal. It? it was an eating simulator. Just Eden Eternal. No, there no, there no. you go. Eden. It's, a, it's, a, it's an inflation. <laughs> again, your inflation Eden. fetish Stop comes Eden. rearing Eternal. its head again. <laughs> do not, do not. I'm trying to flood Please. this fucking server with inflation. I'm not going to stand for it. I don't. Stop. I don't want this to catch to me. Stop this abuse. <laughs> New meme. No. <laughs> No. Well, uh, hey, is it, it, should we do some questions? Or... Hippo is good shit. Okay. That he's playing. Huh? Yeah, uh, you, oh. you, you played all oh, games. Oh, in, in terms of, in terms of like, multiplayer. Games, yeah. Well, it start, uh, Well, my multiplayer, like, game experience was primarily when I was growing up with just my brothers playing, like, multiplayer PlayStation 2 games, mm -hmm. uh, two at a time. Uh, things like, like, uh, Worms 3D, which is, like, the, the first, like, you know, three-dimensional Worms game where you're going around shooting things, and it's, like really laggy and slow and terrible but uh me and my brothers would hang out in that and that would be like the way hmm. we hung out kind of <laughs> mm -hmm. instead of going to the park and playing the b-ball or yeah, the football fuck that shit it's all about the fucking yeah. worms we, we we got the worms we would build <laughs> fuck we would... basketball worms are good fuck basketball <laughs> yeah, it, it, worms and... are good all right enough of that uh, <laughs> um <laughs> 
But we we would spend hours in those like levels, not killing each other, oh, and instead yeah. using the Gerda tool to build fortresses. Oh, cool! Which we would then um, flood, and it, it it never really became about the game. It was always just about you know tr- fucking around. Like we would invent this game called uh you know. I, I, I don't remember what it was called, but it was like you have to kill yourself over and over and to try and like minimize your score. Like the, the, whoever has the least points in, in a, it would go into minus points and you, we would just do that. And, and uh, you can't win by getting minus points. You know, so, uh, I, we just kept going forever. With that, but just, like, yeah, the, sorry, go on, go on. The reason I say that is that a lot of my like multiplayer experience was not with anyone over the internet. I never really liked talking to people in, like, RuneScape or World of Warcraft, because, um, uh, you know, uh, much uh, against, like, the popular belief, people in RuneScape are actually retarded, and I don't like them. <laughs> are they fucking you know. super geniuses playing, like, the most advanced no, MMO? they're actually very fucking stupid, and I never <laughs> liked anybody in, in RuneScape. I never got along with anybody. You didn't even uh, buy a GF. Yeah. Yeah. I did, yeah. I they they're so expensive. I actually did <laughs> go on a GF thing, but I didn't buy a GF. Somebody says I'll be your GF, and I was like, "Whoa, excuse oh, me shit. for free?" Yes, and then we threw snowballs at each other, and she cried and ran away. And uh-huh. I was like, "I didn't know what I, I didn't know." I, you, you didn't I, treat her right, sure man. You didn't did treat her like a queen. That I, was I, your I problem. I didn't use the right emotes. I don't think yeah, I had the that right was emotes. The problem. <laughs> 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 hey, uh, g- g- so did, sad. did you ever play the Ratchet and Clank three online multiplayer? I I I would have. I didn't have. Um, you needed like, that you like needed extra a, box attachment. or whatever thing. Yeah, I think when yeah, Ben and I, didn't I get bought the attachment, I I played uh, that with my brothers as, as again as like a multiplayer. Oh, yeah, thing. Ben and I, I did play with that. them, and and it was like even Minecraft. Like we would have our own server mm. and we would like build our own individual towns and then connect them with like minecart rails and create train stations just Mine the three of us comp. and excellent and we would yeah, yeah very good, very good. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, like when it comes to online stuff like getting into like making friends and, and, and like random people meeting people i it, it i've always shied away from it i'm a very shy boy i'm a very like baby lad and i don't like talking to strangers on the internet they may like take me in their van and i don't like it <laughs> Um, it, it's only very recently that I've started to just, you know, well, actually, no, I've never done it in TF2 or Minecraft, making a friend. It's always been through something else, like, uh, fucking my YouTube channel, or, 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 like, associating with someone who is also a YouTuber. Like, it's, it's, I don't know. I, I have can't... one person from World of Warcraft that I actually considered a real friend, mm-hmm. and I could probably still talk to them. I can I can but relate. Like with all the MMOs I've played throughout my whole life, I never really made friends. Like I I think one time, twice maybe, I joined some guilds and made friends there. But uh, when I quit the game, it kind of just the friendships just kind of sizzled out, and yeah, I never really. I I usually play solo on MMOs. As, as sad as that sounds. <laughs> Mm. I do too. I I like I like soloing like like lower level raids from earlier expansions by myself because getting a group together is a hassle and nobody is good. I nobody remember is good w- at w- that. when I first started playing World of Warcraft, I didn't know what I was doing and a deep social anxiety about like trying to like be good at the game because I just didn't understand it. I mean, I played for like two weeks or something, but still, uh, yes, deep fears, deep fears. Oh, coming back to Minecraft, uh, the the only multiplayer server I've ever played on Minecraft was Pixelmon, which was um, a Pokemon. I tried to set that up. I really wanted to do that, but I couldn't get to work. Hmm. I It worked for me, and it was like, I had a blast. It was really fun. It was like playing Pokemon in Minecraft. You could build stuff and catch Pokemon, and you can like live outside and be surrounded by, by like shit ton of Sableyes, and that was perfect. I loved it. Damn. Nice. And I, I remember when there. Minecraft was fun. <laughs> all, all this, all this sadly, Pixelmon got shut down because Pokemon people shut it down. So all the good oh, things nice. in my life has been shut down. So the only Mage your life was, remains. It was the kiss of death for for all these things. Once once Mage shows up, its days yeah. are numbered. So two gonna get shut down. Why do people saying soon. that? You're like you're like the second person that says that to me in this week. That oh, I, no. like whatever I touch is dead. Is dead. I can't wait for the PCP <laughs> to get permanently demonetized. Whatever Mage yeah. touches turns purple. Yes. Oh, oh god. No. Uh, th- uh, th- there's only one thing I, more I want to say mm-hmm. on, on the subject of, of stories of multiplayer games. I, uh, before we move on to questions here, my 
earliest multiplayer game memory that, that I have is 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 Ethan. We 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 all we all know Ethan of the Special Pack, le- legendary person, a mm-hmm. be- best boy here. I, Pukey I remember, boy himself. Yeah. Yeah. I, b- before I knew what he looked like, before before I heard him, I I was playing Minecraft with him, and then he was like, "Hey, we should join a tiny chat." And then we should like we should like see what each other sounds like. So I turn my mic in in this fucking tiny chat. Which if you know tiny chat, fucking press one for tiny chat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, and, and and I was like, uh, hello. And he was like, ha, your voice sounds gay. And then he turned <laughs> on his voice, and his and his voice was even higher. <laughs> and, and, and that was the beginning of our fucking friendship. It was building Minecraft gay ba- gay bathhouses and, and you know all the associated lore. It Damn. was fantastic, and that's not, and that's. I met the fucking editor of the Spicy Bro Pack was through fucking Minecraft and my, my, my best boy. I love him with all shout out. Uh, yeah, so, so fucking multiplayer games, good shit. That that that's how I made most of my fucking friends. What Which is the PCP look- but a real online multiplayer game? Yeah, where are we gonna make a go. PCP MMO? That's the real question here. The the fucking currency that you can buy stuff with will be the, the PC, PC penny. pennies. It'll be PC a real cryptocurrency. We, we're gonna. It's gonna start Ooh, yeah. with the rowdy fuckers. Once I fucking gamify the rowdy fuckers, cop killers. Um, that, the will the, where, that will like, be the that will be the begin. Yeah, that'll be the beginning. Day by day, you'll gamify it more and more until it is just a real video game. <laughs> I, that's the plan. That is actually the plan. <laughs> it's just gonna, it's gonna have so much feature creep. Like the, cre- <laughs> the, the creature, the features are just gonna creep in. So they're just they're never gonna stop creeping in. Just j- j- just just like creepers, you could say from the oh, famous video game. Oh, there it Minecraft. is. You might, oh you might say just just Maybe. like that song yeah. about creepers. That's like click, click, boom. Da, 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 da. I play Minecraft every day, but not at night. I love click, that. I started with the radio today, and I just That's lost it. my shit. Uh, all right, are we done? Jesus Christ, here? can we get to the fucking questions now, please? I'm dying oh, We've only been I'm going for dying. an hour. Uh, I, well, I mean that we're floundering, is what I'm saying here. <laughs> That's no. what I'm saying. Can this I tell you a secret? Okay, content. Content. Can this is great A. Can I tell you a secret, guys? Okay. No. Yes. I once had a Minecraft channel. Oh, no way. What? What? Yes. Is it called Purple Minecraft or no. dot org? Is no. it called no. FitMC? <laughs> <Yeah. No. laughs> I wish. No. It was terrible. I think it has like eight subscribers right now. It was Is like it still up? terrible audio. Yeah, it had like six videos and then I Will you tell us the name of it or do you want it to be a fun game to see who can get it first? Uh, I won't. I won't say the name now because I mm-hmm. want to review the videos to see if I reveal any personal information on them. Okay. So, uh, okay. by the time the video goes up, if 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 it's okay content, maybe it's it'll be linked in the description if I remember. Oh, yeah. All right. God. Cool. All right. The hunt I'm begins. Excited. Whenever someone brings up that they have like a Minecraft YouTube channel, I always <laughs> feel really bad because it's like there's been tens of thousands of Minecraft YouTube channels that have tried to get their feet off the ground and failed. Mm-hmm. And then you got mm-hmm. me, some mid twenties fuckboy that just comes along and makes a couple videos, and it just blows up randomly. Like YouTube is a hey cool man, well, well, that's life. You were in the right place, the right Minecraft, time, I guess. I mean, like, the, the whole Minecraft YouTube genre is like full of people who just make some th- one thing that suddenly uh, it becomes a new trend. Like that fucking yeah. the 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 realistic Minecraft with the green screen hands oh, that Jesus. we were looking at the other day. And, and you know, furthermore, like the, there's a whole genre of Minecraft videos where a guy just green screens his hands. Yeah, and I, if you're, if you're, if you're, I mean, if you're putting yourself up against like every individual Minecraft channel out there, like you're putting yourself up against people whose just videos are just like, <gasps> welcome to number 25 of my Minecraft mining dirt. Let's play today. We're going to. Spend 25 oh, days mining dirt. You, you know, it's just like that was, that was basically Sherman my Crash. channel. So. <laughs> yeah, there you go. But you you do real shit. You do lore. You did the deep web hacks and stuff. That's uh, that's just got a more more panache, more style. Plus, you <laughs> do a bunch of stuff. It's Nate, good. will you please read the pity question from the Twitter, please? Okay, let's 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 the shift over question. here. Read a little pity question. Um, what do we got here? What do we got here? Please pick a uh, good one. Okay, uh, here's one that's not terrible. At Owl1373, th- this might be an obvious question, but, but bear with me here, um, asks, during the robot uprising, which PCP member will be most likely to be mistaken for a robot? Why do you always... That's a good just, question! Just, you, that's you, you, a, you just I, insist. That's you just good. insist on me? reading the worst fucking that's question not, there possibly that's is. That's the answer. Me. Uh, Davu. Probably. You will see. There you go. No, it's, me. Davu. No one, yes, no it's Davu. No one sees me. No one has seen me. I could be just like an app well, on your phone. But that's oh, exactly... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mage could be a sentient uh, AI. 
Now, have you guys downloaded the new iMage? <laughs> the, the, the new, the new fuck, the new update really fucks with everything and destroys the uh, the, yes. the feng shui. It's it's called the touch of death. Oh no! Oh jeez! No. Uh, um, that no. was terrible. That was terrible, Nate. I hope that was a bad. good question. You just had a bad attitude. That's your problem in life, my friend. Happy you got D, a bad the attitude. Lounge says final verdict: Is it safe to mine at night? A vastly superior question. Oh it's Jesus! Of, the most not, obvious question in the world. It, well, well, it's it's a complicated question. It's not safe, but you should probably do it anyway. Well, l- listen, listen. You the, should you mining at night. Mine at night on hardcore mode. Mining at night is in fact against God's law. You have to understand yeah, that, but but, but sure. that, that yeah, being said, that being said, it's, if you it's a live sin, like being black or gay, that, yeah, that's yeah. right. <laughs> yeah, correct. <laughs> but if you live in anarchy, if you live in a world of madness where you where you are are hidden from the light of God's love, like on two P two B, or whatever. Well, yeah, no, yeah, wait, it, wait. Yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, whatever. Wait, did you actually make a mistake? I, I that was a joke. It, no, wait. Two P two T. Right? 2B. 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 Oh, Jesus. Oh, that. <laughs> there you go. There you go. If you're on there, you, you are hidden from the light of God's love. And so, like, I'm not, I'm not saying that you should do it, but I'm saying that, it is it, like, you can get away with it. But you shouldn't do it anyway. It is a sin. It's of so course you probably sin. should do it, though. Oh, my yeah. God. That reminds me. A few yeah. years ago, there was this troll account on 2B2T. His name was mm-hmm. Build Smash. And he basically <laughs> masqueraded like around it. as this in real life missionary for God. And he would constantly <laughs> post Bible passages in chat and try to like correct people on their like arrogant, sinful ways. And it oh, was it's like me when I was like 13. It's like exactly it's what it. I used to do. do Hell you yeah. remember Bible Bot? But Bi- yeah, Bible Bot was an offshoot of Build Smash, and it's like oh, it shit. was the greatest troll of all time because you've got all <laughs> these Edge Lord fedoras, yeah, and you're yeah. trolling them with God. It is it was the funniest <laughs> thing I've ever seen. They oh, just man. can't resist the bait at that Bible point. Bible Bot is fucking legendary. I fucking love Bible Bot. The, 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 the guy, Ethan <laughs> made a Discord version of Bible Bot that's still in the works now, but you, but you can look, you know you can do. Uh, exclamation point verse and shit like that. It's fucking dope. It's dope as hell. I love Bible Blah. Dude, that's um, sick. Let me scroll up here. Um, um, um. I have a question. Yeah, okay. Do. Uh, by Giffy or Jiffy. Uh, what do you miss most about old school Minecraft? Good question. Good question. Uh, the, the no hunger meter. I miss no the sp- oof sound that Steve used to make. Oh, <laughs> oh that's good. That's <laughs> Is good that one. gone? That's a that's classic. Good. Yeah, now, well, now it's just a cracking of a bone. Oh, that sucks. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> like, h- how old school are we talking about, though? Um, I'm assuming like like early uh, beta. beta okay, I I what I miss is um the lack of choice. There's too many blocks, mm. too many colors. I can't decide on how to like build my base. I and I always default my- to cobblestone and wood because I'm just an Yo, idiot. Yo, dude, and I can't that- be bothered just- to like plan out how to find and get all these fucking materials. Uh, we didn't talk about a little bit like Minecraft, the actual game. Well, see, like, that's the meta of us I, playing Minecraft. I mean, but I want know. I want to put on the record that I think Minecraft is like pretty shit. And like not like fun as like a game. But I think I, it can I, be like, fun. I love to play. I love. I, to play. Play. I, love to I, play. I have okay. to agree because I've never I never stuck with it whenever I tried to play it because I just it's just I would always get in there and then suddenly realize like wait a minute it's I've done this before I just got to break some trees and and build a hut. Well, that's why I, I like I the single player. I, I don't want to lo- do that. I loved Minecraft. I but the, the last time I sincerely and truthfully loved, loved Minecraft like vanilla Minecraft. I played when the horses came out, and my biggest goal was like to make like the biggest stable with all every single type of horse in it. Oh, that's it nice. It was beautiful. It I was mean, so fun. I distinctly yeah, remember the-, the most fun I ever had playing Minecraft, and it was I was like I was playing single player because single player is superior to multiplayer. That's gay. Uh, I was just I was just dicking around, and then I was just like on the wiki because I'm a total noob, learning about like various stuff you can do. And I I decided for myself I want to build a sugar cane factory. Once I decided upon that, to then have to explore the labyrinthine system to get like all the components necessary to make that happen. Labor whatever to make that thing assemble. I needed like I needed like nether or or whatever and like i didn't even know what that is or that the nether even existed so i had to like learn about that and how to get there and construct like an obsidian portal like having a goal for yourself like that and then doing what it takes to get there and exploring the mechanics that way that is the most fun you can have playing minecraft in my yeah. humble opinion um, you just play terraria too. Dw- yeah. dwarf dwarf fortress was the same like i never like i would like set up 
you, you got to make goals for yourself. You got to you, you, you be like, okay, well, how do I build a farm? And then mm-hmm. you go and you look up how to build a farm and you try to make it happen. Now, how do I set up an army? You know, you go and you, you look, you do research and then you like try and, and make it happen. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. I guess I never really set, had like a, a goal for myself. That's the big bump. Minecraft. Once you get that, wanna, it gives you a yeah. sense I wanna, of purpose. I, 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 I want to say a thing quickly. I just, I just yeah. remembered one single mm-hmm. complaint I have with Minecraft still to this day. Like... Mm-hmm. You know, Apple is a Minecraft, right? They were like mm-hmm, there from mm-hmm. almost the very beginning, if not the very beginning. Right. But we still don't have Apple Pie. That is I am some upset. bullshit, if that's true. <laughs> Are there I other pies? Upset. The community yeah, needs to I answer think, for this. Yeah, like pumpkins <laughs> came out, I think, and there was pumpkin pie or something, right? Wasn't there? I haven't played. The, the, yeah, exactly. The, See? Well, the, and there's the cake. Why I said, the, that's the true. reason why, why true. I said Minecraft is shit. It, it, it is for I had one very specific reason in my mind mm. is because they keep adding shit that I don't care about and I think just bloats up the game as opposed to adding things that I actually care about like okay ba- back in the old days there was just like dirt and there was just like you know like stone and, like mm. in, in the underground like those were your blocks now there's like different types of stone but they both look like shit like they look <laughs> absolutely awful yeah. and you would never want to use them <laughs> and they're just it, like I, like i wouldn't be opposed to have like a different type of stone but just make it look like an actual human they're not like a weird ai it looks fucking abysmal and they keep adding yeah, like, the, like the, weird awful things that i just think you're stupid add good things then i like it it's it there's just too much choice it, it it when it comes to like no, designing no a castle or designing an interior of a place, mm. it's you can do anything, anything now. You can you can have okay, multicolored can, carpets can we all and, and drapes. Agree and, that there's not woods. enough purple in Minecraft. There's very there's, there's scant there's, there's scant little. But you know what I will say. Of purple. I will not say enough though. Well, okay. Well, uh, he, he, there was another question that is re- relevant to this. It was Fun Bill asked, "What is your favorite Minecraft block?" And uh, my answer was definitely Obsidian, even though it's like the edgy, like literal Sasuke I like choice. Obsidian too. Yes. Obsidian's purplish, old, old and it makes style, the purple pour old it. Old style cobblestone. Old style cobblestone with the black lines. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, what, uh, what did you say, Fit? What, what did Fit say? My favorite is one they yeah. just are adding now for the next update: the mm. Sea Pickle. The sea the pickle. pickle is the greatest. I, I'm not aware of this. <laughs> yes, okay, so they're, the water water they're <laughs> adding so much new stuff in this update, but it's like too little too late because it's like yeah. it's been eight years already, but they finally added spears and you can do a God fucking damn. dragoon jump in the rain. What and the, the fuck? fuck? And it's baller as fuck, and I've been Dude, waiting for it for I so saw long. the trident. I saw the trident video. It was nuts. That yeah. Is sick. It's goddamn. What? It's like... All this cool shit, but now Minecraft is like going way down in popularity. It's just too little, too late. Like they didn't yeah, give a shit. Yeah. Best block, I, I, mossy cobblestone. That's a good uh, one. Oh, that's dude. a good one. I, I I remember whenever me and my friends would like find a, like like a like a dungeon, I'd be like, take whatever you want from the chest. I don't care. Just give me the mossy cobble. I yeah, only yeah. ask for the mossy <laughs> cobble. That's all I care that, about. That, that, p- p- that, that p- please, sir, calm. extends out his hands. Please, sir, just one more mossy cobblestone to sustain mm. me, please. This I, cake I'm looking, at the, like I'm looking at the sea pickle, and this looks fucking yes, I'll gross, count that. but like really funny. Okay, I also like cake. Actually, I'm not oh, sure if that counts, oh, but whatever. My my, my favorite, my <laughs> oh, favorite my block, favorite. my okay. favorite block, and, and which I made like like I like my my first two b two d base was made out entirely out of this material was like melon brick. I love Ooh. the melon, melon brick. brick, and that you can like make your food into like a construction. Well, hang on, Qu- question, question: Is that a brick, or I thought that those were just literally like melons, like they just are cubes? Yeah, they can Is that be not... used as uh, construction yeah. material. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you can. Yeah, well. Sure. Okay. Uh, okay. It's just when, when you said brick, I thought you had to go through a process to convert a melon into a brick, and that's no, what I was, no, no. Okay. No. All right. No, I, I, got, I, got yeah. I'm, I'm just saying, as opposed to like, so it's like a literal edible, thing. edible house yeah. that you can just eat if you want to. Exactly. It was. <laughs> fucking, it's beautiful. It's fucking that's like, sick. I love oh, the melon oh, brick. Cakes and melons I, I are the only uh, food sort of things that you can put down, right? Yeah. And what's what's, 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 hay bales what's kind of cool about bales. cakes is that on two B two T, when the lag is so severe that you can't even eat. Cakes are the only way to stop yourself from starving to death. <laughs> Why cake? they're a right what, what? click and you instantly fill up your hunger bar, whereas with the other foods, you have to have the uh, eating animation. Nom, 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 nom. And it takes yeah. like five minutes sometimes if the TPS is blown. <laughs> <laughs> so so like you'll be, you'll be trying to eat it, but your, your stamina will be like ticking down and you'll just like die before you can actually get the thing in your face. Yeah. Mm. Oh, okay. okay. All right. All right. All right. Cake is OP. Word. Cake is good. Uh, I, I changed my mind. My my actual favorite block is the sign. 
mostly mm. because of like the history and the memories it can invoke when you go back to a place that you remember writing a sign in and you're like, oh, oh yeah. I, I happened upon a sign. That's the literal words I wrote like five years ago. I happened whatever, upon a sign, like, just the beginning of uh, two B two T, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right. We, we've come full circle. Uh, uh, that just said uh, a little arrow, not sucking dick, 2018. That was it. That was the whole scene. It was good. I, I okay. I think like everything I said. Minecraft is actually the best video game ever made because because of because of this. What happened? I remember distinctly saying to one of my friends, "Dude, you should be able to like write books, like like write." Oh in books yeah. For this game. Like, wouldn't it be cool to do that? And they're like, oh, "That's never gonna happen." And I was like. Yeah, you're right. Next update, you can write in books. That is oh, that is I a remember. game changer right there. That is a game yeah. guys, changer. Guys, guys, I just remembered with the books. Um, one time I had like I hosted a little server, like it was a bit of a role play server between me and mm -hmm. my friends, and I wrote the whole story, and they had to follow the story, and they had to find books to continue uh, the story and stuff. It was really nice. really oh, fun. Yeah, That's awesome. That sounds fucking sick. Hey, hey, somebody was just talking. You were talking about feature creep. I just wanted to say that a feature creep is literally what completely broke Terraria and made Terraria boring and shit. Because it you no longer retarded. You literally have no fucking brain cells left in that game. No, you not, uh, Terraria. Terraria originally all. had a very clear path line that went from like your base house, then you go to like jungle biome. Once you've built yourself up, and you've mined some decent ore from underground. Then you eventually get to like the I don't even remember. Like other stuff happens. Then you get like, like to the, the fantasy realm, the, and then the, the, there was a the linear path that was literally fun. Literally did not affect that. It, it made it, it that, so you... bloated and clunky and annoying. The, the, the features they added didn't add any new fucking biomes all they fucking that's not add true. was more shit to do the fucking what? What? the bee the beehive was a new one that's one uh i don't know that, there was that's just stuff. in that's just in the, that is just, okay that is just a small structure that is inside of the jungle oh, so you need to go there anyway pshaw <laughs> you're fucking faggot terraria is okay perfect. to be fair i haven't actually played terraria since those updates but it just looks <laughs> shitty just looks <laughs> shitty <laughs> You'll fucking ruin the Oh, yeah. Oh, I, I log into Terraria. Oh, good. I got, like, the Santa DLC in my fucking chat. Oh, hooray. DLC? Thank you, Terraria. Thank You're you, Terraria. Dead, Nate. It's You're basically dead. DLC. You don't, only you don't free. fucking know fucking shit. <laughs> Base Terraria was OP and GG to you, Munchie. Speaking of Terraria, I think it's the same people who made a new game called Staxel, which is kind of hmm. like Stardew Valley and Minecraft had a baby, and that's a game I like playing. Didn't I didn't get behind babies? Didn't the Terraria people make like some like some like Starbound, my friend? Starbound, yeah, some perpetually early access shit shithole. I heard it wasn't good, but I, but I don't it was really like know. A big disaster. Yeah, I don't know. Hey, hey, hey! F fucking fucking Ethan himself asked a good question. Oh shit! Um, um, yeah. Shout out. Uh, where do you see the future of two B two T, or more broadly, if you prefer, Minecraft heading? Oh, great from question. From my perspective, I've seen several Minecraft slash two B two T YouTubers switch from uh, to other forms of content altogether, and it seems as though the server slash games decline as of late due to the oversaturation of Minecraft based content. Hmm. What do you this think, Fit? Ask question. Um, what, what do you think, Fit? For two B two T, as long as there's like at least ten people playing on it, and a couple people pitching in for the server costs, I don't. Mm -hmm. I think it will end once Housemaster just gets bored of running it. But it, here's the thing: Housemaster has a cocaine addiction, and he needs oh. to fulfill this cocaine addiction. So he <laughs> needs as many shekels as he can get from all the players on two B two T. He will run this. As long as he can. But Damn. Minecraft itself, mm -hmm. I actually mm -hmm. think because it's just a game that you can put on any platform at this point, I mm -hmm. think I see it like still being played by a somewhat relatively large player base for years to come, I would say. I, I agree. I, 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 agree. I, feel exactly I don't think it's going same. anywhere. I, I, mm -hmm. I think that the decline in popularity is actually fucking great for, for specifically 2B2T mm, because mm. no one wants to deal with the queues. Uh, like th that's like the ma that's like the major thing that if they like removed the veteran queue, I think I haven't played in a while. Fucking travesty. But, but, but the main thing is, Wait, what's is the that queue? what, the, 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 because 2B2T, like people, a lot of people want to join it, but also like it, you, it's not a huge server or anything. So you can't have any people on it at once. Uh, oh, there's like okay. a queue to get in, so like you can be put in like a you know like a hundred player queue, and eventually they'll tick down, and then when it's your turn, you can get inside the server and you can stay there for as long as you want. But anyway, the the main thing, the main thing that I think is good is that it, like like once two B two T becomes like like a niche thing, like I think Minecraft is kind of heading like like just generally like obviously it will still be like a big game, 
but like it's nowhere near the popularity it had, and it'll eventually just it like like it eventually will die the death just became like a niche game. That will be great because then the community will be small again. You'll just be able to have that 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 like rich small like like you know everyone on the server and you, and 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 you uh you know you know what their deal is. I, I that's great and I, and I love that and I miss that because I joined like before like the, you know the Russia invasion and stuff. Mm-hmm. So I so I really miss that uh small you know like thirty players on at a time in the middle of the night. I miss <clears> that and I think it'll be good. Hey, I got I got two questions here to read. They're they're I, they're I very important. Well. Okay, th- th- okay, these won't take long. Uh, first, <laughs> Meme Manifest asks a question. Uh, do you agree that Minecraft sex mods should make the boobs more seeable? Fit, would oh, you care to comment? You <laughs> <laughs> like, wait, I was reading a statistic. Wasn't it like back in 2014 on Pornhub, uh-huh. like, Minecraft <laughs> was one of the most searched terms? Yes, <laughs> <laughs> it was. That was Hell that yeah. Mind. Like, what the fuck? It's incredible. Uh, wha- I, I think if this Baffling. guy doesn't like the way the boobs look in the Minecraft sex mods, he needs to get on it and 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 fill that uh, fill yeah. that yeah, demand yeah, himself. Yeah. There's he, a demand. He should be the change dude. he wants. Meme to see manifest. Well. Meme. Well, you know what? To be fair, meme manifest is asking if they should be more seeable. So I guess it's a okay. taste question he's asking. Okay. Here. Um, I don't know. Uh, it's it's mean, up to you, man. Why, why would you have a sex mod? Like, well, have have multiple seeable. mods, man. Make it so you make a, a sex a boob slider. You know, let us let us <laughs> choose. Let us choose. Uh, and here's. Ar- artificial Academy 2 mod for Minecraft. <laughs> for Minecraft, yeah. And here's, oh my here's God, a second you know question. what Artificial Academy is? Of course, of course. Of course. Uh, what a legend. Uh, um, okay. Mozilla Fennekin asks another question. Do you even lift, Fit MC? Do you even lift? <laughs> oh, God. Well, what do you have to I say mean, about that? that? Nate, you and I are both uh, browsers of the infamous Fit board. Infamous, first, that's right. Uh, when I first made my channel a couple years back, I'm like, well, I play Minecraft, but unlike most Minecraft <laughs> players, I actually go to the fucking gym. So <laughs> I just called yeah. myself FitMC, and then, like, at first my fans were like, oh, this is probably some fat guy in his 40s, like, he's just <laughs> playing yep, yep, Minecraft yep. all day. And then I did my face reveal, and they were just, like, flabbergasted. <laughs> so, yeah. Yep. yep. Got him. <laughs> Dabbed like, on those haters. Uh, like a true fit boy, I have an Instagram account too. So I, of course, you know, yeah, you have to. Congrats! Yeah. You know there was a, there was a, the original title for this episode was going to be fitness and Minecraft. There was going to be a double topic extravaganza for Fit MC. MC. Unfortunately, that but, but, lost but, but, to the but to the winds of time. Be on, uh, the, the fit oh, let's do fitness and have Fit MC back. Oh, yeah. that would be legendary. Yeah, if you're fucking lucky, if you, if you play your cards right. <laughs> <laughs> um, all these questions. Are I, I have a question. I, I, I oh, yeah, 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 yeah. By Smickelkun, which do you like more, mining or crafting? For me, it's definitely crafting. I love crafting. I like making. But things. but how does one craft uh, without previously mining? That's well, a chicken and an egg problem here. No no no. Like, see what what do you like more? It doesn't mean like you you, you mean, can't okay. do the okay. other one. Just just. Does, I, I assume crafting includes like building yeah. and architecture. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I prefer well, the crafting. Course. I think I lean toward more towards the mining personally, because you you know I'm a guy who loves grinding in video games, and mining is just like you're you're, you're de- like it, like when you're when you're mining, you can just be mindlessly doing that while like listening yeah. to like some a let's play or you know just mining, like content online or something, whatever, man. Podcast. Mining is just it's, fun. it's just like some chill, it's just just a tune out and just start just start whacking blocks, and then with the occasional little dopamine rush when you find. And yeah, when you, when you find something good, like you're, you're always good. mining for a purpose, so you've always got that. But when you're like in the eight-hour grind of mining out your your expansive, you know, underwater uh, pleasure dome, then you mm. know it's nice to just <laughs> zen out and do that. I've I have listened to entire pod like from beginning to end of an entire podcast mm-hmm. while mining. Sure, me too. Yeah, the too. problem with mining, though, is that you're doing the same repetitive task over and over, which means you have a lot of time to think. That's and true. that usually leads to an existential crisis. And that's why <laughs> I think crafting is infinitely better than mining. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Crafting. All right. If you've got a lot of demons in your head, you're definitely going to lean on the crafting side of this. Yeah, that's that's cool. Cool. What you see with this? Oh no, I've been exposed. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Is there anything else here? You I think we're good. I, th- I think I'm good. All right. Fit, fit. Is there anything you would like to plug here at the end here? Um, in true fashion of being a fitness slash Minecraft YouTuber, follow my Instagram, FitMC yeah. Sippy Cup. Boy. All right. That's <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Hell Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Well, it's been fucking great. It's yep. been fantastic. What a great time to have you on here. And it's so nice that you like our content in general and, uh, you know, been watching what we're doing and 
great to meet you. Great to talk to you. Yeah, I was trying not to fanboy. Uh, same. Uh, same. I, I still cannot believe it. we have fans. I just, I just can't. <laughs> <laughs> One day. Doesn't yeah. like, period. Yeah, period. Period. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's so like, true, though. Hashtag it's stay like humble. That, that meme with the woman being confused in those math problems around her. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Oh, man. So what should we get exactly edit of Mage's like OC meme. with, like, the fans around it, like, the yes. names and, like, the ats. Please Lots of do. ats at Mage. It's a good one. <laughs> all, right, all right, guys. I think this is the end of this episode of the Procrastinators podcast. It's time for plugs. There's only, there's, 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 for there's, plugs. Only, there's only one more thing you have to say, and that is... Goodbye. Actually, there are a couple what? things to say. For example, oh, well, if you like our then. bonus episodes, which I might be episode edited into this episode, I, I I can't remember. We've got like twelve now. Pledge fucking five cheap ass dollars, you cheap piece of shit, to our goddamn Patreon. Right, we had to shill at the we've, end. Got, we've got we've got to, yeah. to shill, my dude. Uh, uh, Patreon people, five dollars, all the bonus episodes. What was the last one? I can't remember. Uh, we just did it the other day. We just Red did uh, Radcon three. Uh, re uh, that Radcon, oh, right? We went truly the Rad behind Con the scenes. Recap the Radcap. The that was what I was trying to say. There's a little bit of a, a private behind the scenes uh, Radcon discussion in there. That's good shit. Plus all the other ones. So it's, it's a cornucopia of good shit. Uh, and if you pledge as low as one dollar, you get into the Discord chat. So give us as much money as you please, and you get to hang out with us some more. Uh, hey, <laughs> send us, uh, follow us at TP Crastinators on the Twitter. Uh, we uh, we do the questions there for free. And if you're not paying any money, that you probably won't get your question picked. Uh, but we put out updates in their stuff, so it's good to follow us there and uh, subscribe and like. Please buy our go. indie game that we just had developed. It's called Minecraft. <laughs> it's a sandbox game, uh, you know, voxel based. Oh. But, it's, but it's not just sand, there's, there's dirt. <laughs> yeah, there's right, goddamn trolls. Go? Right. Yeah, it's time to go, everybody. Thanks for listening, right, and we will see you next week. <laughs> bye bye. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Uh. I'm supposed to. Two.